All right, time now is 9:49, and of course, happy Monday to you. It's time for around the community with Javier, the X Man, my good man, Javier. Good to see you. Good morning, Eric. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. Where where did the weekend go? It was just Halloween, right? Right. Now we're ready to go. November is here. November ready for is here. Uh, Dia de los Muertos. Exactly. And that's actually <laughs> the first thing we're talking about, right? A big celebration going on. Yeah, it's the 26th annual Dia de los Muertos at the California Center for the Arts in Escondido. Everyone's invited. It's happening today, and the museum and courtyard will be open for all guests. This is a good opportunity to gather together as a community to honor and remember our loved ones who are no longer with us. Uh, the center will stay true to the tradition and have altars outside the museum for anyone to use, available at first-come, first-served basis. So if you have a photo of a loved one you'd like to share, you're more than welcome to. And they'll have dance performances by Aztec dance group Sinachli and the Sierra Caliente Academy of Arts. They'll also have craft tables, a DJ, an artist in a craft market as well. All part of the festivities. Plus, uh, they're going to have three uh, exhibitions highlighting artworks referencing Dia de los Muertos oh. and to uh, celebrate Mexico's rich artistic heritage. So come on out. Be part of the event today. And that event is free, correct? Yeah. Yes. Yep. Come on out. Have some fun. <laughs> All right, Javier. Uh, the next one, filmmaking training and internship here. What's this? What's this all about? Well, the Media Arts Center San Diego is looking for someone who's uh, interested in making movies, film. Why not? This is a paid film making training and internship opportunity. Uh, this paid six week crash course teaches you the basics needed to get a job in media arts field as well. So we're talking videography, photography, audiovisual event services. This training series will give you hands on experience with equipment and the opportunity to learn from local media arts professionals like uh, yourself, Eric. Uh, they're seeking <laughs> older teens, young adults, ages 16 to 24. So uh, apply today online and see if you get in. But this is a great opportunity for someone who's interested in, in making film. Well, I have to say, too, I learned a lot more during the internship process rather than a textbook. So just going to say there that. you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, my favorite, uh, of course, out of the segment, the mom and pop shop of the week. Who are we featuring this day? Today, I'm taking you to Adams Avenue, uh, Soul Shack Records. This is another one of those businesses that opened up right before the pandemic hit and had to shut down, but they're now fully open, ready for business. Chuck, the owner, is a music lover and loves talking about music. I'm a record collector, so I found this place to be the perfect place to dig for musical gems. They buy, they sell trade music as well. So if you got a stack of records just sitting at home and you want to trash them, don't. Take them yeah. there, okay? They have a wide selection of music uh, from rock to soul, new wave, DJ 12-inch records, 45s, which is what I love. Plus, they carry cassette tapes and CDs, too. And they also have clothing, art, and pop culture items. So if you're into that stuff, they got them there as well. And uh, something for every everyone out there, especially for the holidays. You're looking right. for that special gift. This is the place to go. Soul Shack Records on Adams Avenue. And uh, talk to Chuck and uh, Todd out there. Good people just uh, selling good music to everyone. So come on out. We're going to tell them Javier sent us. All right, Javier, the X-Man, good to see you, my friend. Uh, good information as always. Thank you. Take care. Have a great work week.